stalking the deadly red bell pepper. killed it. I guess I'll have to clean it and eat it. This is one of my other favorite little pastimes. Uh, this is actually quite a lethal little piece of kit. Uh, but that only comes with practice. As you can see, your darts are... If you want, you can harden your tips with crazy glue or Geez, you can make this out of stainless steel wire if you want or whatever, but these these are these will take a squirrel um, But gee, you know place your shot really well and that means you got to work you got to practice you got to get good with this thing <clears throat> That was a, a, a one one breath one dart one kill sort of a scenario and uh, uh, That's what it needs to be for uh, if you're gonna hunt small game and stuff with one of this and have any chance of uh, doing anything with it uh, you might slow a grouse down enough so that you could knock him on the head with a pipe after. I don't know. It might kill a grouse outright. Um, I can't say from personal experience whether it would. Maybe we'll take another shot at this. I took my shot on that from just off camera. There's about seven or eight paces away from the pepper. So here at the camera, oh, it fell over. There we go. That's about seven yards. Just load up with another dart. And they're just they're just friction friction fit in there. It's easy to carry a handful with you or in a little pouch of some kind. You see, one dart, one hit. That I, I can't emphasize that enough uh, because I don't believe in uh, causing needless and unnecessary suffering in anything that I hunt. One shot, one kill. No matter what it is that you're using, seek that as your goal. One shot, one kill. The only thing that stopped that from going all the way through is the fact that uh, it flares. So really, uh, I guess I'm allowed to say these really aren't a toy. They can be. Oh, and you can have fun indoors in the winter with these if you set up a target and uh, have your friends over and have some wobbly pops. It's uh, it's a great way to recreate. But uh, that's what I did. As I <laughs> okay, here it comes. Uh, I practice with this quite a bit in the winter. <laughs> Draw your own conclusions from that about the other stuff.